For a given rocket, we need to find the mass of the rocket as a function of time. It's given that acceleration of the rocket is constant and the gas is escaping with a constant relative velocity u and initial mass is m0. So the relation between mass and time. So this is our standard rocket equation which we have seen in previous few problems which is m d by dt is equal to minus mu into u vector. So we are given u vector that's why we have written it in this form and d by dt is given as constant. Now we have a mass term already and we need to introduce somehow time in the equation but we cannot use this because dv by dt is constant. So on the right side let's see how we can introduce time. So here you can see that mu we can write as a function of time which is minus dm by dt. So why we have added a minus sign so as to make this whole term positive because mu is a positive thing mu is the rate of discharge so to make this also positive we'll add a minus sign because dm by dt is negative as the mass of rocket is reducing with time. So now we have a term of m and we have a term of time so we are good we'll just cross multiply integrate and get our answer. And here there is one more crucial step up to here we are writing the equations in the vector form. And here we are removing the vector signs because the vectors are collinear anyway but their directions are opposite. So the direction the acceleration of the rocket is opposite of that of the velocity of discharged mass. So if you remove the vector sign we must add a minus sign also and now the equality again holds. So yeah this is our answer.